Welcome back, Game Week King family, to another F1 Clash video. We're here for our qualifying round for the winter event. Can't believe it's winter already, but we're here for the qualifying round. Let's jump on into the contenders. So I was planning on buying uh, the 10x offer for the winter event, but uh, the next event is going to be the Equinox event. Should be the Equinox event. Uh, and that's going to be a better boost to get the Eclipse boost. It's going to be a lot better boost to get than this uh, Frozen boost. So I'm going to stay away from this Frozen boost until the next event, which is the Eclipse boost. So I can get uh, a few of those. All right. So for now, uh, we're going to be jumping into our qualifying session. We have Lando Norris level 6 with Verstappen level 7. And see what we can do here. All right. Remember to subscribe to the channel if you're not yet subscribed, turn on post notifications. Also remember to smash that like button. Uh, let's jump on into this one. Here we go for our first match on the US. Let's see what kind of qualifiers we get. I haven't been testing the qualifying range of Norris and Verstappen with the buff. Uh, so, um interesting to see where i'm going to qualify if we're going to go p8 p11 and if we're going to range from like p8 to p14 yep so p8 p11 and we're probably going to be ranging from p8 to p14 is what i think the range is going to be right, let's go softs with norris and we're going to go rooster uh, with norris for some tire management and a little bit of grip and for verstappen we want to go with some tire management uh, and some corners with Taurus. All right, let's go. Right, let's see what we can do here. We're going to start off with the fast launch method. I'm not even sure if it's still working, uh, but I like to still do it anyways. And it's a real player, so we'll give him a little good luck. I like to still do it uh, just in case if it's working. We'll get the advantage if it's not working, then uh, it is what it is. All right, down the inside there from Lando. Nice, so we can cut that off now. And we got a pretty okay start with both our drivers. We want to give Or Verstappen some support so he goes down the inside. Pick up that, that position. Let's give him some more support, see if he can squeeze on the inside here. No, he cannot. All right, so we're going to try to go for three laps with Orlando Norris. Come back for two. Uh, and we're going to go for long with or uh, with our Verstappen. It's kind of, ooh, man, Verstappen just took that corner horribly. Now Lando Norris took the corner horribly as well. And Verstappen just follows suit. Let's see if we cut down here and get back on the inside. There we go. Cut down here, get back on the inside. Yeah, we got, well, we got on the inside there. We should get that position. We should. Give him, some, so give him some support to keep that position. And can he pick up Gasly? No, he cannot. Give him some support. Oh, man. Verstappen. Crazy. All right. So we're on our final push. So we're going to push this lap with or Gasly. And boost our Verstappen here. So he takes this corner fairly quickly without losing. We see the rival losing out there on that corner. And we see the Orlando Norris picking up positions. We're going to go to pit with no service in for Lando. As we're going to go around with Or Verstappen for another lap. And come back to mediums and boost the finish. So we're diving into pit here with Or Norris. For a no service in pit stop. And then we're going to boost Or Verstappen right about from there. So we got our no service in pit stop and we're basically going to be boosting him for two laps. As Orlando Norris uh, or Verstappen boosts away uh, to come for his pit stop to mediums. So we want Norris now to make up some positions. Make up some places here down the inside. Verstappen holding that line pretty well, leaving Norris to go wide. You see the rival uh, going into pit now. And we should pass him while he's in pit. See if we can squeeze by Verstappen. AI here. Come on. What tires is AI Verstappen? Oh, no. That's not good. 
that is not good news finally we passed ai verstappen that was not good news for us there and we're gonna just leave or or verstappen to be on full boost uh, for the rest of the race and we're gonna bring back now for norris for a pit stop with servicing on soft tires let's see if we can squeeze him in front of signs put it in there he swings in no breakdown because we're right at the pit that he's going to take a good amount of time on servicing hopefully we get out before that p9 yes we do and we're back out p8 on full blast Verstappen taking that corner pretty wide there. Right, so it's a matter of now boosting with Ornoris from here to finish. Him picking up some positions. He's uh, behind Soft Alonso, medium Leclerc. Once he's behind Softs and mediums, uh, he should be good. I don't know what's going on with, with AIs on hard tires. Seems to be very difficult to overtake AIs on hards. But once they're on softs and medium, you should be able to get the positions. If they're on hards, it's going to be technical uh, for your drivers to pick up positions on them. All right. So both drivers picking up some positions here, making their way up. See if we can dive down the inside of Leclerc. We tried for the inside, but Leclerc defended that inside line beautifully there. See if we can go for it down here. Nope, we went wide. He defended and hold his line. Let's boost by pit. We're about to go on low fuel. We want to see if we can squeeze in front of Leclerc. There we go. Squeezing in front of Leclerc with now low fuel. And or Verstappen is also on low fuel, so he's not going to team orders or Norris. All right. So looking good, we have AI Verstappen up ahead on some softs. We might can push at that last minute. Uh, we're too far away. To catch those hearts will he run out i doubt it yeah great race man good luck thanks bro all right so we're not gonna catch so we're gonna boost there cross the line to secure or win and there we go nice race for us we managed to pull the win here and we're going to take a quick look at the rival. See his level. So 36 to 35. Nice score there. And so he had a little bit higher team score. So we, I guess we have like the same drivers. Yeah. So level 7 Hamilton with a, versus a level 6 Norris. Same kind of drivers. And basically the same kind of parts. Though we kind of have a level 5 True Grit in there. I kind of lower our car a bit he has the flux in there with the claw all right so let's jump on into our next race here we go for our next race on spain all right so i think this one we're going up against a gwk legends uh, so I'm definitely not going to be pushing this race too much. And whenever you go up against your... Look at that Lando Norris P4 in qualifiers. Nice. Whenever you're going up against a teammate, uh, you want the, the player with the best uh, drivers and parts. You want to give them the best opportunity to go through. Uh, since it's in the qualifying round here, I am not going to be pushing this race at all. I could still try and score as much as possible, but I'm not going to be pushing this race too much. Yep. Yeah, so there, all right, there he goes out for P1 and P2, and I'm just going to chill, kick back, and let him go. All right. So Norris up to P4. So we're going to cut him down there. And let him secure that one two we could probably score as much as we can because we're, we, we're not going to be scoring a one two anyways so we can go and score as much as we can uh, at the end of this race and we could still put up a good score uh, and get through there 
All right, so bipolar weather it is for this one. It's Blue Orlando. All right, and we decided to use no boost because we're going up against our teammate. We don't want to fight with our teammate. He has better parts than me, so I allow him to put up a better score. If it's a case where uh, I, would, I was getting a bad score, uh, then we would uh, go again tomorrow. Trying to get Verstappen to go down the inside. Not happening. All right, so it's going to be dry. Then it's going to be some more rain coming in. In a few seconds, more rain. Let's see if we can push or Verstappen to try and go down the inside of Gasly here. Everybody's on wets. All right, so this is where the interesting part is going to come in. I'm going to be going to pit for mediums here in lap four. I'm going to go to pit for mediums, boost. I'm going to pit for mediums, boost. And then it's going to be sunny. Then it's going to be rain. I wonder if it's going to be sunny after this rain. Let's see. I'm going for mediums though. I'm going for mediums. Sunny, then rain, then more sun. Nice. Nice. So we selected the best tires uh, to get the best out of four drivers here. Oh, we got blocked. We got blocked in the pits or stopping. And we see Christopher going for another lap. <laughs> Slowing down some of these cars. All right, so we're now going to be on the soft compound. The track is going to be dry. Oh, no, it's just building back up. The weather is just building back up. Come on, Verstappen. Make your way through. Make your way through, Max Verstappen. Let me see who's on. Oh, everybody's still on wets. They did not go for softs. Oh, heavy rain coming. So we need to pit now for wets again. Let's see if we can pick up some positions while... No, go for wets. We need wets. Because heavy rain is coming. So we're going to try and pick up some positions. Alright, then we're going to just dive in for wets with no servicing. Wets with no servicing because it's going to be heavy rain. So the track is going to be really wet. Ooh, we dived in too early with Verstappen, but it's alright. It's all right. It's here comes that heavy rain. We need to get off of these slicks uh, and get on to those uh, wet. So 34 points. We're in a good score. We're at a good score. So overall, it's a great race. Great race, man. Well done. And say good luck. All right, man. All right. So we still came back to put up a pretty decent score. Uh, for ourselves, 35 points, 34 points it is. I uh, will take it. In this bipolar uh, Spain, matching with a teammate. There we go. Let's try and secure P12 here so we don't lose to Alonso. Cut that down. So that's basically going to be it for this qualifying video. Uh, I wanted to give you guys uh, all four races in the qualifying video here, but uh, the time uh, did not work out for me here. Uh, so that's basically going to be it. I'm not going to be showing you guys uh, Christopher's uh, setup. Uh, so yeah, there we go. All right, looking good. Here we go for our next race. Surprise, surprise. So we're doing all four races in qualifiers. And in our opening round, we're going to be doing all eight races, but we're going to be doing it in two separate videos. So four video in the first part and four video in the second part. And we're also going to be doing that for the finals as well. So for those of you who have been asking for all eight races in one video, you're now going to be getting all of the races 
uh, in a few separate videos. All right, let me know down in the comments if you guys prefer that or uh, if you don't, let me know down in the comments. All right, let's jump into this next one. We're gonna go Instinct. And that's for Verstappen, he has good time management already. So we're gonna use a boost that we have a lot of like the gin here. And let's go. Ooh, all right, so we just got a call, but we couldn't uh, take that car. Ooh, hopefully the person does not call back. We, we had to decline to save the game. So hopefully the person doesn't call back. Hopefully, hopefully the person doesn't call back. All right, let's go. All right, so good start from Lando Norris. Okay, start from... Verstappen, we didn't even get to see where they qualified because of the call coming in. Uh, but we'll, we'll, we'll possibly see in the next one. So Lando Norris doing pretty good for himself. Verstappen doing pretty okay. Let's give some support. See if he can go down the inside. There he goes, picking up that position. Looking nice. Let's cut him up to regular drive in here. And then we'll start to use uh, some boost around the boost portion of the track. Like down the back straight here is a nice little straight to get some overtaking. But he's too far behind so we could cut him back down there and not just waste. And not waste our boost uh, right there. All right. See if we can squeeze down the inside. Yes, we can. So we'll cut back down again, and then we're now we're going to be boosting or Norris in uh, and bring him back to pit here. And we can boost Verstappen a little down the straight as we want to mostly boost him on the next lap. See if he can get the overtake done. Yes, he can. Down the inside of Gasly. Come on, we got that overtake. Let's cut him back down. We got that overtake, but it's all right. We're going to come back to mediums for or Norris, and then we're going to boost or Norris. Uh, to finish on those mediums then we're gonna boost or Verstappen around for another lap he did pick up Gasly eventually at a later date that we didn't see but <laughs> he did get the overtake done all right so we're gonna boost him now and we're gonna bring him back in for softs and we're just gonna keep that boost on or Verstappen here so he closed that gap Nice, and try to create as much distance as he possibly can uh, to get a nice clean pit stop. Ooh, nice overtake there from Max Verstappen on Lewis Hamilton to catch up to Lando Norris, who seems to be struggling with going around AI Norris, who's on hard tires. Now he gets the position. Here we go, 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 go. Nice exit P9 on softs. We should hold P9. And we have mediums and a few cars on hard tires that will be going to pit. So we're going to keep that boost on him. He should close that distance down a little bit. Uh, and possibly catch up uh, all of those cars on hard tires up to P5, which is Norris, as he goes to pit. So we should possibly get by Norris uh, as he's in pit. We're stuck on Russell on those mediums. So can we clear Russell down the inside? He goes, swings in. Norris coming out behind. Now down the inside. There we go. Clearing. Uh, George Russell beautiful overtake there from Lewis Hamilton and yeah looking good cut down here take that inside line no inside line available blue flags move out the way Vettel and stop blocking my car down the inside there we go nice drive there uh, where is or Verstappen he should be right behind us if he was like right behind us he could have picked up there but we don't want a team order, so we really don't want Verstappen too, too much behind us. Let's see if we can clear Leclerc. He's on softs. That's going to be a hard one to clear since he's on soft tires. Uh, and there you see we did not get to clear him. All right. Ooh, bad corner from Verstappen for the last portion. But 3-5, 42 points. That's a good score uh, for us there. All right. All right, 
So let's jump on. Let's take a quick look at the rival and then we'll jump into our final race. And then I'll also speak on something that I've noticed so far in this event. All right. There we go. We got the higher team score and there we go. He had the faster pit time. So he had an inflated team score via pit time. Here we go for our next race on Hungary. It's going to be the final race of the video. Remember to smash that like button. Let's see if we could get 200 likes on this video. That will show me, got, show me that you guys really appreciate all four races in the qualifying round here. Alright, nice qualifier. P9, P11. So we're in that P8, P14 range. <laughs> Once again. Alright, so we're going to go Norris again here. And for Verstappen, uh, I want to give another boost that we have a good amount of. Alright, let's, let's give him the Eternal Flame for Verstappen. We have a lot of those boosts, so we could use those. Alright, so we're going to aim for the fast pit start strategy and see if that works. As I said, earlier in the video i'm not sure if it's still working uh sometimes dr your drivers pick up some position like that you see norris just moving up to p4 uh, sometimes they pick up some positions like that and another time they'll lose position so i'm not sure if it's the pit uh, strategy that's impacting uh, those position gained or those position lost all right sometimes you'll pick up another time you'll lose Currently, there is some something in the game with hard tires. Cars and hard tires seems very difficult to overtake. Uh, currently, the overstaffing kind of squeezed in there and get that position. All right, we want to go for four with Norris, and then we're going to go for five with our Max Verstappen. So we want to pay close attention to both drivers and see that there is no car attacking. We see that number nine of Perez now attacking our Verstappen. So we have to be very mindful, take a quick look what tires Perez is on soft, so he's on the better compound to attack. So we want to pay close attention to him and give some support where you think he can possibly get the overtake done. You want to make sure you give supports that position. Try to squeeze down the inside of Carlos Sainz. Yes, we did. Block Perez. Nope. Perez got through. <laughs> I was hoping that Sainz would have blocked Perez there, but Sainz, Perez got through anyways. All right, so we have Hamilton, and you see Perez still on the attack. So you want to make sure you just keep your driver in a good position uh, and not let him get overtaken. So we're going to boost now. Boost here. Ooh, come on. We Oh, man, we got that position. We started boosting early. We should have kept our position there, and we're not going to be able to dive down the inside of Perez. Yes, we can. Squeeze back in front. Beautiful overtake there from... Oh, come on. Come on. Come on, Max Verstappen. Let's put in our go-to-pit artist for Lando Norris. All right, Perez should be going to pit now. And we're basically going to boost our Verstappen for the next lap. So we're going to boost him here. Uh, so we can try to squeeze back in front of Perez. Squeeze back. All right, so he's going to go to pit now. And we want to boost away. Down the inside of Hamilton. Good overtake from both drivers there. As we keep that boost going, picking up, nice, nice, nice. And we're going to go back to pit, come back to softs. Lando Norris all the way out there. Ooh, nice. Oh, come on. We got Verstappen there. We got Verstappen. What tires is Verstappen on? He's on hards. All right, we got him eventually. We got him there. We got him eventually, though. Nice overtake from Lando Norris. Up to P1. He's going to be securing P1. Come on, we want to get out, get out, get out, get out, get out, get out. Five seconds in the pit. That was a long pit stop. Squeeze down. See if we could break to the inside on Perez there. All right, so Perez on fresh medium. All those cars and hards, we should be able to get them while they're in pit. So what we want to do now is basically squeeze by Perez here. So we can close down that car up to P5, up to P4. So Russell should be the only car in front of us with Perez. All right, we got Perez here. So George Russell should be the only car in front of us in P4. There he is. And then we can squeeze these softs uh, to go and catch up to George Russell and get P4. 
for or for stopping here. I wonder if we're gonna have enough fuel. Now let's cut down here to regular driving to save some of that fuel through these portions. Then we'll boost him back up right about there. Squeeze. We're about to go out of fuel. This is the last chance. Ooh, there we go, out of fuel. He got the inside line. Cut him up to regular drive in to squeeze in front. Squeeze in front, there we go. And then we could cut him back down right there. And that should be good enough to hold off George Russell. And we could just use uh, regular drive in and cut down like that. Regular drive in and cut down like that. And create that distance that we need on Russell to secure P4. There we go. And then we could just boost right back up. Cross the line. We don't want to run him out of tires. We want him to do a nice finish lap. All right. So there we go. Nice little 45 points for us here uh, at our last race. I think this track is hungry. Yep. Nice 45 for us there. So overall, a great qualifiers. Let me know down in the comments if you guys like this new format where we're doing all four races. And we'll be doing the opening round in two separate videos of four four races and the final round of two separate videos of four four races as well if you see this white thing on my finger that's paint because i'm painting <laughs> for christmas <laughs> anyways uh use code word uh what should we use for code word uh, use code word continue down below to let me know that you made it to this portion of the video we didn't get to look at that rival now one thing i have noticed uh so far in the opening round is <clears throat> the mirage if you notice i've switched out the mirage uh, for the last two races so the first two races i did with the mirage and for the last two races i've switched back to the whirlpool all right because the first two races i got matched with two strong players and the last two races i got matched with two okay players so it looks like the mirage is back to its always whatever uh was wrong with it while it was working good it seems to be it was a issue uh, uh, forced by the last update so it seems like they have been working on some of these issues and they have fixed back the mirage to where it was so it's now giving you those strong matches again so be mindful of using the mirage uh, in your races all right so that's basically going to be it for this one and i'll see you guys in the next one peace let me know down in the comments how you guys are doing in your events and that's basically going to be it catch you guys peace well good guys Shout out to Marco Pedrana, JJ, Vidmantis, Christopher Graves, Alfredo Jr., Nathan Arsenio, and Touch My Dilly.